knocked down by Shine. Mm -hmm. So you'll not be able to catch in that sort of combo. But yeah, Troy punishing off of it really, really well. Mm -hmm. uh, looks like Mario Bros is. We have that down tilt quarter. That was a pretty staple finish from Mario. Looks like Troy was being a little greedy there uh, and catching him with the crush cancel. And, and anytime you hitbox off stage, you're like you're getting into a really. really Shoulder, uh, sending out a really weird angle, not really going to have a strong knot back that you regularly see. Ah, uh, yep, that time, Troy ready to go through with the shine. And, and yeah, that was game two, so Troy will take that set. And it was good. Uh, we saw Troy implement, implement a lot more shines. Mm -hmm. It looks like Mario Bros. not really knowing how to deal with it, especially since mm -hmm. a lot of the options that Troy was throwing out were immediately being crouch canceled. So right. going for the shine, really disrupting that. Right, yeah. It seemed like Mario Bros. had like a good like baseline game plan, like crouch canceling all the stuff, looking for down tilts, um, trying to use that to get through the pressure. But once like Troy started adapting to that, there wasn't too much Mario Bros. had like after plan A of that, where like he got lots of times where Troy was like pressuring his shield and he tried to do unsafe things, like up smashed his shield and Mario Bros. just rolled in rather than like wave dashing out of shield and mm -hmm. punishing. Uh, and I mean, you 